I have a really eclectic team, actually. Like, they're really, really emotional. I always get the emotional kids, which I love. And even the adult one, there was always the emotional ones. They're really supportive of each other. They all seem completely different. Um, and they all, which is amazing, they all support me as much as I support them. And I, I love how they understand that the respect, the respect to each of us is mutual. So there's like a really solid feeling already. It's great. To experience being in an adult kind of situation at such a young age and have the expectation to, to really, you know, to be able to switch it on when you've had a long day at school or you're tired or you've fallen out of your friend, you know, or you lost your packed lunch, stress, um, huge help. And then I just last year in January to April, I lived in China and I entered a singing competition in China and I was a contestant for four months. So I got to experience that side of it at the age I'm at now. So that's hugely helped. So that combined and my love of singing, teaching and kids, I mean, this is it. Yeah, I always get nervous. Oh yeah, I'm nervous now. <laughs> like, if I'm not nervous, something's wrong. People go, oh my God, I'm, I'm nervous. And I'm like, yeah, you better feel that. You better enjoy it because you're nervous when you care about something. Nerves are good, because it means that you want to do a good job, you know. So when I, my, my, my team were nervous, I'd say, claim it, own it, don't, be, don't push them away. Tell yourself, I'm nervous, you know, like, nerves are great. If I'm not nervous, something's wrong. It's down to the audience vote, isn't it, at the end, so whatever we think, it's down to you guys to vote. So please vote for the person that you feel deserves to win, not because you think everyone else will and then they end up not winning. It's amazing to be on STV. My sister's married to a Scotsman, so I have lots of uh, Scottish family and I'm always there visiting, so I love Glasgow. One of my first ever newspapers I was in was um, the Edinburgh Festival's newspaper and I'd had my hair dyed red and blue, like with spray paint. I went to see this um, really intense magician at Edinburgh Festival and it kind of traumatised me, but like really inspired me to be kind of different and crazy. Um, my sister got married outside in Annan. It was freezing and then everyone was in a kilt um, and there was like uh, the, the Scottish like, traditional band at her, at her reception and so yeah, trying haggis for the first time before I was vegan.